I'm Dominic Cruz, this is Carl Gebhardt. He's gonna be acting out Wei Li, and I'm gonna be Zhao Min. Now in this fight, these two both have wicked side kicks. So both of them are using this kick right here on both sides. So the question is, how do you land that? Well, it's gonna be with fakes and feints. They both stay very bladed too. But when we're talking about Zhao Min, she likes to fake like this on the inside, on the, from the side like this in the side stance, and she uses it by attacking the inside kick first, attacking the outside calf. And once she gets you lifting that leg and going to check it, that's when she side kicks and goes to the face or the chest. Danny Castillo, you can hear her saying those kicks are adding up. She's starting to really get a little momentum going here in these last two rounds. The thing that makes her tricky also is when you try to attack her, she's moving. So if you throw a leg kick, she doesn't just check, she's moving this way. If you throw a high kick, she leans. If you throw a body shot, she moves. She doesn't just stand there and eat the shot like most people. Jonan, always moving, always bladed, always flipping stuff up. She also throws a lot of spinning attacks. Yan Xiaonan has had a lot of success at distance, throws the spinning back fist there. After she does this and gets you biting, when you go to return, she'll pull you and land her own right hand also. So what makes her so dangerous, Xiaonan can fight moving forward, and then once she starts touching you, making you mad, and you start chasing her, because she's hard to head off and hard to grab with her footwork, then she'll start pulling you where she wants you to get the angle and land her big shot. The speed. So she's got a mixture down on. If you're gonna chase her, she's got the side kick. She'll keep the space. She'll keep moving side to side. And if she decides to stand her ground, she can clinch you up, go for a takedown. And if you decide to clinch her up and go for a takedown yourself, she'll keep the hips away circle. Keep it where she wants, where she can throw, and then she'll move. If you're pressuring her too much, she's just going to keep moving, not let you grab a hold of her. And now you're chasing her, which is exactly what she wants. Very tricky, very hard to get a hold of her. And then on top of that, power in both hands. Front kick coming up the middle. Big right hand connection for Yan Xiaonan. These are some of the tactics you'll see at away Lee. She throws this kick right here to the knee. She'll just stab it straight down. And then she loves that side kick all day. That's there on a southpaw. And she'll start tagging this inside. You'll see the second the stance switches, Wei Li makes the adjustment and she'll start firing here to the body and here to the head. And the reason is, notice she's facing my power side. When the stance switches, lead leg is now what you'll see Whaley use the most. So she'll throw inside kicks, she'll throw body kicks, she'll throw head kicks. She's not just throwing her left kick to throw her left kick. She's comfortable throwing the kick that's the most advantageous for the stance that she's facing. Nice body kick. Oh! 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 You'll be getting touched with the legs, you'll be getting softened up from the outside, and then bam, she fakes the kick and steps in with an overhand right. Very sneaky. Oh! Oh! Biggest shot of the fight right there. So the shorter fighter, we're gonna see Wei Li looking to condition the pressure. Keep it going, just keep, keep Zhao Nin from moving. Yeah, she's gonna wanna pressure, head her off, not let Zhao Nin squeeze out the cracks and doesn't wanna follow her. This is what the typical thing that Zhao Nin wants right there. She wants, to pull, she wants to pull you, get you chasing her, boom, and then hit you trying to pull her. Wei Li is not gonna play this game. Wei Li's gonna do when, she's, when she bolts and faints and this person starts to cut out, it's gonna be that. It's gonna be this. And then the side kicks are gonna start and then find it. She's gonna head off. And then once that starts happening, this person sits the ground, Xiaonan, that's when the takedown comes. So overhand, boom, to a single. One of her best takedowns we see over and over is once she gets to the single, she pulls it up tight, and it's just a single leg dump, basics, 101. Pull it tight to the chest, and you tuck, the, tuck this single leg while you push your head into the chest, and you just create, you remove this, this post right here that's keeping them up. Oop, right there. Drops her level. Again. Beautiful Easy. single leg. And this is where we leave really tough, actually. She's so good at staying in this top position and just staying heavy. 
right here, staying in the, keeping this shoulder in the chin, her opponent, so that they can't move their head. And then she'll keep this leg here so that they can't turn towards her. She wants you to go away from her. Yes. And then she's looking to get on the hands right here when they're on all fours. She just wants to keep this hook and just keep rinse and repeat, punch, keep the waist. And then when this person gets tired of it, she'll get the top position, keep them here, and just keep doing it. Boom, boom. She's always looking for mount, Whaley. Keep this top position. She can't get them out. They shove it back into to half guard right here. She just stays right here, real tight. And she's just overpowering the most on the ground. In this fight, I think if the grappling's gonna happen, it's gonna be that Zhao Nan got taken down and she's gonna be working her way back up. And if you watch Wei Li, she's very good in top pressure, very good. We saw against Lamo, she controlled that fight for almost two solid rounds on top. So if she gets taken down, we're gonna assume she gets to a single leg, Wei Li gets to a single leg, boom, overhand, gets it, dumps it, gets her to the ground right here, boom. Now, what are the steps that we're gonna wanna see out of Zhao Nan to get off this position, okay? So first off, Wei Li's very good on top, so she's gonna be looking for this half guard to hook up the leg with her leg and scoop it and sit on top of it. This is what Wei Li's gonna wanna do, is hook this leg with her leg. So first thing, get safe. Get in the side position if you're zone on. Second thing, get this leg out. You got this leg is pinning her to the ground. She's gonna wanna get it out and you can do that by creating space with these hands and getting this knee involved. So I'm gonna push, get to a hip, get the knee involved. Now you see this foot, while there's still pressure on it, and if you can sit down on it, I can now work it out, get that foot out. Now that all my limbs are separate, my arms, my legs, now I can start to turn. Now from this position, obviously I gotta be safe, there's a, or be careful, there's a lot of options, but she's got a single leg here. Shoot down to a single leg right here, get the hips out. Now this person, you can get on the neck, she got guillotines, all that stuff, it's okay, stay safe, get on the hands. Circle out, get back to the feet where she's safe. Jan did a great job staying against the fence, keeping on the wizard, which is that overhook, and pushing the head positioning of Dern down. Taken down, this is like worst case scenario for Zhao Nan. She's gotta get to a hip here and get in between the chest and the top position of the body up on top of her. First thing, get to a hip. Second thing, push the head down. Now right here, there, see? The grip has to let go. Whizzer, and now they're isolated. When they try to go to a double or grab my legs, I've got this overhook here. This overhook allows me to create the space I need. They're gonna keep their hips underneath them, yep. They're gonna stand up with me. I stay on the hands. Typical takedown, scoop it out. Single leg escape. She's relentless though. Let's see what she can do with this single leg. Great defense from Jan. So we're here, one more time. You're gonna see her get to a hip. Push the head, right here. Wizard, which is an overhook over the arm. Look at my feet. Because of this pressure, they can scoop it. They can hook it with this leg. They can hook them all up, so I've got to Get up on, wizard down, use my wizard. There, now that the hands are broken, stand up, get on the hands. You've seen this a million times. Underhook, jack up, turn the corner, get out. See how her, her back is never flat on the fence. It's similar to being flat on the floor. If you're flat on the floor, you get choked or you get hit. Wei Li is gonna be looking to stay heavy, which means that Zhao Nan's gonna have to make the right movements, get to the wall, Make sure she gets to a hip, make sure she makes all the right decisions because if she doesn't, we've seen Wei Li squish people to the floor. 